guys, so today I'm going to be reading Super Potato. Super Potato's Galactic Breakout. So let's get started. One day on the spaceship, a resort and a dirt slug king. You know what would look good in my collection of Galactic Beasts, one fateful robot? Yes, your majesty. My calculations indicate that I've been told 473 times. I already have a Buzzillion from Planet Buzz and a Humphillion from Planet Hump and a Zarina from Planet Zash. Yes, your majesty. Majesty, I know you, Majesty. Even to have a dusting cloud of living comet, cosmic lint. I only need an Earthling from planet Earth. But don't worry, my little robot. I will soon get one. I'm not worried, Your Majesty. Shh, yes, you are. I am worried. I am worried. Okay, enough. Beep. Yes, Your Majesty. Now let's catch uh, that earthling. Beep. Catch the earthling. The slug king knows how to motivate his subjects. 42 s sluggish minutes later. Catch the earthling. Catch the earthling. Meanwhile, at the super potato place, our Husiro is doing a bit of weightlifting. Grunt doing some push ups. 415, 416, huff, 417, and flying a few miles or two stand shape. A super Potato always, also likes to do some pirouettes and, see, and to see how high he can go, which is very high. At that moment, for the first time ever, a vi an alien visits Earth. Catch the Earthling! Here we go! The hunt begins! Yes! Ooh! I see one! I see one! It's so ugly! And it flies! This is going to be fun! Let's get him! Huh? Super Potato. He always appears when he's needed, even though if it's by accident. What an alien evasion? Not exactly, but whatever. <laughs> How about that little robot? Is this the one? Fire your majesty. We'll try uh, the stun blast first. Hey, watch it. Zrrt. What are you trying to do, Space Beast? S beast, me, wretch the earthling. Surrender, surrender. Ah, clock. Let's see how you like this. Let me go, let me go. The earthling is strong. Grr. Very strong. Grr. But not as strong as my hunting craft. Ah, yes, yes, yes. It's over. Good catch, your majesty. Right. Ah, I can't move. One last tiny step. Long live at the slug king. An or a portable energy kennel. Bravo, Flit. Ah! Now we may return. We have captured the Earthling. We have captured the Earl Earthling. Oh no, where are they taking me? Good question. We have captured... Let's give that a rest, robot. Ah, deep. The hunting craft, of course, is heading for the dreaded royal ship of the Slug King. Super Potato is in the trouble of a, a cosmic dimension. Exactly 73 minutes, sluggish minutes later. Let me go, you can't keep me in here. Oh no, oh no. Poor Super Potato, but at least its effects of the stun blast have worn off. Grr, blam. Oh, what's the matter? Are you angry, little earthling? I won't give up. I'll take it easy. Even the powerful rock from planet Rockle can't escape my collection. Who? That over there. What's wrong with all of you? We have to get out of here. You can't stand. You uh, can't stand there doing nothing. Can you hear me? You'll get used to it, just like the rest. Fiend. What's it saying? No idea. I would. I'll put it into robot in the universal translator mode. And bef and uh, you shall bow before mine is the magnificent uh, of a uh, plan of Micron and the end of translation. Man, that Micronium always uh, does the same rant. 
Do me a favor, my little robot. Mm, beep. Clean up in here while I take my nap. Yes, your majesty. The sight of the slug king and napping isn't very interesting. So we could, should uh, keep our eyes on Super Potato instead because, psst, hey robot, rub, 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 Super Potato has a plan. Psst, I've seen how your king uh, treats, treats you. It's not good, rub, rub. He lies those, uh, uses those buttons on your chest to control you. He's forcing you to do as well. He's made you your puppet. Remove stubborn dirt. Whoosh. While convincing the robot to switch sides won't be easy, and the truth is Super Potato prefers problems he can solve by punching them. Rub, rub. Thinking gives him a headache. Ugh! But sometimes it's necessary. The brain of Super Potato in action. Clank, clank, clank. Aha! Hey, robot, take a look! Your buttons clean, rub. They're covered with dust. Oh no, I can't have that. Well, you know what to do. Clean them. Clean, rub, beep, beep. Clean, robot, clean. Clean, 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 clean. Beep, 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 beep. The obedient robot has activated all its functions at once. It begins to shake. Overlord, ha, 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 ha. Girl. Wow, your tea is served. And it starts speaking Micron, Rolkoglon, and the Kilogonin, Fat Forward and Backwards. And Robot? Finally, the robot sings, Daisy, Daisy, you're the daisy of my heart. Crazy, crazy, I'm so crazy for your love, huh? Robot, you okay? Better than ever, I've always wanted to sing. Daisy, Daisy, give your heart to me. Well, that's great, robot, but why don't not let us loose so we can hear you better? If the slug king knew what was going on, he wouldn't be sleeping so soundly. Dreaming of glorious hunts. Suddenly... Ooh, ah, ooh, ah, ooh, ah! The alarm, girl. The slug king always wakes up grouchy. Robot, grumble. That clumsy robot bumps it, bumps the alarm every time it cleans. Beep, Daisy, Daisy, Daisy of my heart. Was that my chloracle from Planet Cork? I'm so crazy. What the? Crazy, crazy for your love. Uh, thanks to Robot po Super Potato, the robot has opened every cage. Daisy, Daisy, crazy, crazy. Unfortunately, the ro volcano fly doesn't seem to along get along very well with some more gunlin airworm. And the, the powerful Rog and the Broly of Polo don't like each other either. The truth is, uh, the slug king has filled his collection with some of the most savage creatures in all space. Quit fighting, we're free! Super Potato had not taken this into account. Okay, fine. You want to act like tuck for guys? Sorry, my Kronian, not a good time. Blam, I dot, zerp, boom. I said... Stop fighting, Bump Crew, and you, Crew. Stop it, girl. No eating at the others. Plop. Sir. Ah, oh no, the stun blast. This time I'm going to hunt you one on one. No one escapes my collection. No one. Daisy, Daisy, and you, robot, you little traitor. Is right. When I reprogram you, you. You won't be able to sing ever again, Zrut. That's enough, Slug King. It's enough when I say so. No, Zrut. This ends now. Back, Crash. Hunting season's over. You little pest, give up. Don't make me dump you. Oh, let go of my iPod. Do you surrender? Girl, do you surrender or not? Ah, oh, yes, yes, I surrender. Now what's going on? Who's attacking? It's it's the Micronian Amanda. Now 
Armada, now let me go. The macaroni and the mar matter. Yep, the macaroni and the matter. Ready to rescue minus the magnificent, the king of my planet Micron. The Micronian take a care of, take take a control of a slug king's royal spaceship. Let me out of here. You can't do this to me. I'm the king. What's gonna happen to him? Huh? Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. The spaceship on the, of the Slug King, guided by the Myconians, uh, drop at the former prisoners off on their home planets. The powerful Rock returns to planet Roggle. The Chlorco returns to planet Chlork. And Super Potato returns to Earth, of course. What beauty! Goodbye, the miners. Have a safe, safe trip uh, back to Micron. And uh, bye to you, uh, Slug King. See ya, never. Grr. And this ends, and so ends this incredible adventure of Super Potato. But rest assured, to re assure that there will be more. Farewell, my friends. Uh, and uh, for those who care, the robots has uh, become uh, an all-demand singer across uh, the galaxy with a smash hit. Daisy. Ooh, Daisy. So this is the end of the book. I hope you enjoyed my video. Please subscribe to our channel. Bye!